my darlings and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be all about my favorites from really August and September and the gratis I've received this month. So it's going to be a long video. So go grab your drink. I got my cherry Dr. Pepper. And uh, yeah, grab some snacks uh, and let's just get into this. So last month I only had like two and I carried them over for this month even though I haven't used them as much this month as I used them last month but they're still favorites they're still great the whole collection is great last month the Morphe and Jeffree Star collection I picked up the entire collection I got the palette I got the brushes and I got that funky spray and I still have the spray everything in the collection except the spray was just awesome and as you can see I really do use the brushes a lot they were from yesterday's look I have not cleaned them yet I'm gonna clean them because I'm about to film another look so I love it if you haven't picked it up this is what the palette looks like this is what the palette looks like I absolutely love this palette the shimmers the glitters the mattes just mm, everything in here is just I'm really glad that I picked it up but the brushes the brushes for me they really did make it where I could get rid of some of this old funky brushes that I just never touch anymore and they are all well loved as you can see the only one I have not used is this one and I'll probably be using it next month when I start doing a lot more um, stuff on my face for Halloween so I'll probably use this one since it's a very fine line I just don't use most of the products that you would with that until about this time of year um, but yeah I really every day I use this one this is the brow one um, I use that one every day uh, these guys right here are my ultimate favorites this one is actually stained blue unfortunately uh, this one's just dirty I need to wash them but I absolutely love 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 this collection and I would definitely recommend picking it up to anyone who needs some new brushes um, so yeah that whole collection minus the spray i'm trying to get myself through the spray once i get through the spray it's gone i'm good bye so that was carried over from august another one from august is the sephora brush tip lash adhesive and i really really do like this one it has a brush tip on it let me just do this so you can see it a little better it has a brush tip on it and it is a really good lash glue it stays it does not budge I like the packaging I really like a brush on tip I don't like ones you have to you know squeeze out and then you have to work with and brush it on I'm good to go so yeah that's all that I had for August that carried over into this month that I just was like I don't have enough but now this month I have a ton and it's all sitting right in front of me along with the gratis that I got this month I'm gonna start with my skin and then we'll go from there I picked this up during the VIB sale it is the ordinary um, the cold pressed rose hip oil you guys, I've been putting this on my face every single night pretty much since I bought it. My skin has really, really loved it. And I'm glad I picked it up. It was only like $9.90 or something like that. And then I got an additional percentage off because of the VIB sale. I'm still learning day by day everything about uh, that I can about skincare and what different things do for skin and things like that. But I've always tried to learn as much as I could about oily skin and something I learned a few years back was that if you're not if you're constantly stripping your, the oils from your skin and you're not adding them back then your glands are gonna overproduce they're going to continue to you constantly strip it it's gonna think it needs to produce more because it doesn't have enough does that make sense get yourself a new skincare routine and start adding oil back in you'll probably see a change in about a month it's different for everybody but definitely if you're struggling with oily skin Put an oil back in. I know it sounds crazy to add oil if you're oily, but trust me, your face will thank you for it. The next thing that I have been loving right right now is I got this a couple months back. This is the Ulla Henriksen Banana Bright Face Primer. It's vitamin C and banana powder inspired pigments. I've been wearing this underneath my next favorite, which is the Anastasia. I only have a little sample of it left um, because we've been out of it. It's in stock now, but it was out of it uh, for the longest time. So I got a little sample to try at home. This is the new Anastasia Beverly Hills Luminous Foundation. I am the shade 140 in. I am obsessed with this foundation. I never thought I'd like a dewy foundation, but I put this on first. Then I put another favorite on, which is the Farsali Liquid Glass. I got a sample of this as well because the thing is $54. And I was like, let me see if it works first before I purchase it. So I put this mainly in this area across my nose in my t-zone like in the areas where I have like large pores I put this in the rest of my face and then ABH and that has been my jam for like pretty much this entire month like I am obsessed with that trio right now 
it might stop working October it might be a whole nother thing it might stop working for me and I end up hating it but hope not if you haven't tried the new luminous foundation and I'm oily and you would think that a luminous foundation I wouldn't like an oily foundation but let me tell you I told you I had a lot of favorites this month okay so when you pair it with the Laura Mercier translucent powder and the Makeup Forever Mist and Fix honey your face don't move <laughs> my face does not move it does not stay oily it's just this combo is working for me right now so this is my these are my favorites currently I'm gonna probably look back in October and be like what was I thinking because I'm gonna find something better or I'm gonna continue on with this crazy combo that I've got working and I'm gonna love it um so yeah that <laughs> So that's a lot, I know, I just threw in on you. Everything that I talk about will be in the description box, so check that little box below. Something else I've, I am loving are the ColourPop liners and the ColourPop colored mascaras. These have been so fun this month. I think I've done a look using almost every single one of these um, <laughs> this month. So if you're not following me on Instagram, click that uh, description box below and you can find me on there and uh, you can see all the fun looks that I've been using with these mascaras and with these liners the liners stay put they don't move um, if you have watery eyes like I do the outer like rim area not so much the middle middle right here just it stays there's a multitude of colors that I have I need to get the rest of the colors this is not this is by far not all of them at all but now that I know how good they are I'm, I'm getting all of them let me tell you and then the mascaras so these are all the colors that I have for the mascaras I also have a black one too these guys are just they're great so if you really want to do like a monochromatic look for sure get yourself some of the colored mascaras and liners and they have a ton of the nine pan palettes you guys know I'm obsessed with those so that pretty much covers makeup and skincare for my favorites so this last item in my favorites list is from the matrix it is a um, keep me vivid shampoo and conditioner and I got a sample of this from the salon and I thought I'll just give it a try and see how it works with my colored hair because y'all know I change my hair every month if you are new here I do change my hair every month uh, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on October's colors colors <laughs> um, but yeah I, I really really liked it and I was like I need a full bottle of this basically the full bottles of these are like $14 a piece or something so I'm just waiting I'll probably pick those up when I do my new hair color because I like the little packets and I you don't need a lot of it at all so I can get away with using a packet for like a month so this is like my last packet of it so I'm just gonna go ahead buy the full-size ones and be done with it so that is all I have for my favorites I know that was a lot I'm trying to get through this really quickly so it's not so long for me to edit and so long for you guys to watch the last thing I'm going to talk about are my items I got in gratis this month. Um, we do have quite a bit of stuff that is still or that was ordered back in like, I don't know, July maybe. It was the new Naked Foundation. I know I talked about this. We still have not received the Hello Happy Concealer and Foundation and the Urban Decay Naked, the Urban Decay Stay Naked Foundation. So those three things are still missing, but... It is what it is. Um, it'll come eventually, I'm sure. I hopefully will get it soon, and then you guys will see that in a future uh, end of the month, Friday Favorites and Gratis Haul. I decided I'm going to go ahead and group the two together because um, we get our Gratis different times during the month. It's not like, here you go, here's a bag for you, of goodies for you. No, it just kind of happens whenever we do training, and it kind of, it just yeah it just it just happens when it happens so this month I have five items I have a full size of the fresh sugar strawberry exfoliating face wash it gently refines and softens this is what it looks like so it just has a little bit of it's just a little exfoliant <laughs> I can't wait to use this actually um, I have a spot like right there that um was a pimple I messed with it the so next I got something I'm really excited to try it is a youth to the people superfood cleanser and it is a mini size it's the kale green tea spinach vitamins superfood cleanser I don't remember what it smells like because I, I have smelled it in store have not opened this one gonna open it mm, it just smells really fresh and um, green <laughs> You want to smell? <laughs> it just smells really fresh and green. I like that. So I'm excited to try that one. Of course, you guys know we don't keep boxes around here. Um, although, um, there's some new stuff coming out. I, I think I want to keep the packaging on. So next we have a mini Lala Retro Whipped Cream. If you guys have not tried anything from Drunk Elephant, 
Oh my goodness. Okay, so the Lala Retro is really good for dry skin. I really like the Proteiny Polypeptide one. That one is more for oilier skin, but this stuff is legit the bomb. It doesn't really have a strong scent. Like, it just smells like, I don't want to say chemicals because that's wrong. It just smells like ingredients. <laughs> it just smells like good ingredients and everything from Drunk Elephant is like that. Everything from them is it's one of our clean at Sephora brands and it's like it's just it's just a good brand and it's you get what you pay for too so yes it's expensive but again you are getting what you pay for and when you buy something from Drunk Elephant you're getting really good clean products and I'm so excited to have this because I love it I love a good moisturizer and moisturizer even if you're oily you need to be moisturizing too so the last thing that I got in gratis this month are the Sephora little mini five minute masks. I got the bamboo mask stick for mattifying and then I got the watermelon mask stick for nourishing. I have not actually played with these in store. I didn't realize we were getting these until last minute. Oh, that smells so good. So it's just a little five minute mask. Basically apply it to clean dry skin and leave on for five minutes. Rinse with warm water. Boom. You got a five minute mask. And you're out the door. I gotta get this off there though, because that's gonna drive me crazy. Oh, that's so satisfying, but I gotta get that off. Like, it drives me crazy. Being oily, I love me a mattifying mask. And, you know, it just might do the trick. Ooh. Ooh. This just smells like. It smells like green. I mean, it, it definitely, you can smell the bamboo. We have quite a few of these, and I just, I think they're really cute. They're new, they're little sticks. Go get you some of these. They're very inexpensive as well. Like I said, I'll have everything linked down below. So, yeah, I think that's everything. Uh, if this is the first video that you're watching of mine, my name is Wendy. I make a video every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I would love to have you as part of the Darling Makeup family, so hit that subscribe button. Also hit the notification bell, so you're notified whenever I upload a new video, which might be a little behind. Getting ready for Halloween. Working a lot. Busy. Hope you're doing well. <laughs> I will see you guys in my next video.